prime things about beliefs with this. Everything is neutral. And you are deciding what you make it out to be, what you believe it to be. Positive beliefs are an open spiral like the Fibonacci spiral. And if you don't know what that is, you can Google that later or the golden ratio, the Fibonacci spiral. It's the way nature unfolds. It's the way life unfolds. And in those beliefs, we find inspiration. We find growth, freedom, and choice. We find that movement and that flows easily along that. In a negative belief, which is not expanding, which is contradicting and closing in, it is more structured. We're trying to come up with a, with a, a, a metaphor that will work. It almost, it's almost like a funhouse mirror that shattered and has many, many facets. And what happens is, is when you get caught in a negative belief, the spiral, instead of expanding, the spiral contracts and it starts bouncing and ping ponging all over the place. And you tend to feel like you're stuck in it. The negative belief is where fear, paranoia, judgment, um, rationalization, rejection, all of blame, all of those things are, and they cause you to bounce around and bounce around and bounce around. And that's why you seem to get stuck in them. Now, here's a key. The other thing that is in a negative belief is doubt. Now, doubt does not necessarily sound like a positive thing. However, doubt is an exit. Because if you doubt things, doubt things are happening, doubt this, doubt that, you can also doubt that this belief is real. You can doubt that this is true. You can doubt that the information that you're being given is true, and in fact, that it's false. And once you start moving in that direction from doubt, now you're starting out of the spiral, and from there, you can reach for hope and move up. We started by saying everything is neutral and you're deciding what everything means for you. When you lean towards a positive belief, you are saying this is better and these are the reasons why. And you tell yourself an appropriate story about why this is better. And when you lean towards a negative belief, you say, this is better, and these are the reasons why. And then you get caught. Now, did you catch that both are the same in the fact that you're looking at it and saying, these are the reasons why? You have the ability to choose in any situation because everything is neutral and you're deciding what it means for you, you can redecide. So if you had been saying that the negative side is better because of these reasons, you can now choose to pick the positive side and say, no, wait a minute, this is better because of these reasons. And start focusing on that and shifting your focus. You are telling yourself the story of which is better in every situation and you're choosing in every situation which way you're leaning. You can almost think of it as a, as a scale or as a balance. Are we filling up the positive side or are we filling up the negative side? And the way you do that is by deciding one side is better and telling yourself the story of why that side is better. So to change your belief from a negative to positive, 
first you choose and decide that you're going to do it. And then you can write down the reasons you can focus on why this is better.